man, I wonder why Tim seemed so triggered by this whole cyberbullying harassing thing. Couldn't be because he took uh, stuff from my messages every day and put it in his videos and kept breadcrumbing me that something good was going to happen until he was fit into my routine and I watched all of his shit every day. And then I had to stop because uh, all he did was, uh, all he was doing was uh, psychologically uh, torturing me, apparently. And now I go in and troll the hell out of him because he deserves it. I'm like, I don't care if he's getting blackmailed at this point because what he did still remains true. What he did still remains true. And his people still can't stop. They still can't stop paying so much attention to me, little old me. Why you pay so much attention to me? Why you pay so much attention to me? Huh? Because <coughs> you know. Because you know. Because you know. But nobody will do anything about it. Not even Tim. Hey Tim, you could have walked here by now. I mean, you have millions of dollars. You could have got here by now. But, but if you say you're being blackmailed, all of a sudden it's okay to keep doing the things for years and years and years and years and years and years and, years and keep doing it. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. And the way that you would harass and bully me and, and then make me go crazy and then uh, have some send somebody over there, send somebody over there to my page to get it, get it deleted after telling the truth about you. <sighs> so, I guess the cards are wrong. They're just demons. They're just demons. Like, like Justice says, they're just demons. All the numbers and the cards and everything, it's just demons. It's just demons telling me things are right for me, even though I channeled the things in fucking Vegas and all that. They're like, you, you can't erase, like, my memories, even though you've tried, apparently. Even though you've tried, apparently. How long did I not have that memory? But, like, three, four years before it finally came back to me? And then it all started coming back to me. All in little pieces. All in little fucking fragmented pieces. But nobody can talk to me. It's okay. She can have fragmented memories for the fucking rest of her life that don't make fucking sense. I don't have to talk to her. I can just use her for my own personal enrichment. And then when I get caught, I can say I'm being blackmailed. But but I won't say who or why or when because that, that would make me look guilty, right? And then... And then she'll send somebody over there because you say you're getting blackmailed and nothing ever gets resolved, right? But really, Timmy's just a piece of shit that steals from people in poverty because he's had more than enough time to make it right. And I'm not going to beg him to make it right after he fucked it up, but that's what he wants. He told you the other day on a live stream, that's how he operates. He wants to point the fingers at everybody else. Oh, the Democrats do this. Kamala's doing this. She wants you to beg for it. Yeah. Yeah, she wants you to beg for it. She wants you to beg for it. Five years of fucking torture. You better beg for it, bitch. You better fucking beg for it. You better fucking beg for it, bitch. You better fucking beg for it. I know I took all your ideas and manipulated and all this stuff. And those two biggest shows that got deleted off of YouTube, they were... Mostly because of you. Mostly because of you. Those two shows happen mostly because of you. But, you know, I can never give you credit. Even credit. I can't even give you credit. I can't even get, give you credit for all the ways you, you've enriched my life. Hey, I'm going to tell a story about how a girl tells you have nice eyes. And you remember the compliment for the rest of your life. But apparently you can't fucking do anything about it. What the fuck, dude? Why are these demons on the fucking road this morning? 
Are you fucking kidding me? I'm just going to the food bank, which I wouldn't have to be going to if some millionaire, some millionaire didn't just take all my shit from me and breadcrumb me for five years. Hey, something's good's gonna happen. Something's good's gonna happen. You better stop talking shit about me. Something's good's gonna happen. No, I'm not gonna stop, stop talking shit because you've done this for fucking years. What a fucking weak ass motherfucker. Look, no girl wants to marry Tim. No girl wants to have Tim, uh, no woman wants to have babies with Tim. No woman wants to marry Tim. He only wants to take from a girl that he was supposed to do all this with and give it to Allison. Like, remember when I said, oh, I have this idea for this card deck, and the very fucking next day, or the very fucking hours later, oh, Allison said she had an idea for a card deck. What the fuck? What the fuck? Yeah, it wouldn't have been a big deal, right, if you hadn't been doing it for years and years and years already. But what the fuck am I supposed to get out of that? Except that Tim is using me to enrich himself to give to Allison. But I'm somehow envious when he's the one that bought the things that I told him I wanted in Vegas. He didn't want those things. I wanted those things. Then he put a he bought a property with Papa, and then he bought an inversion table, and he put it on Cast Castle to brag about it. And then he never went and got his girl because the plan wasn't to ever get his girl. The plan was to use her. That's why when he when he approached me in Vegas, this is one of the reasons why I didn't give him his not my number. Right? He's talking about how 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 people can be manipulated and shit like that. He's a fucking creep. He's a fucking con man. My goodness. Uh, but apparently James O'Keefe loves fucking con.